um, and we did talk about this a little bit yesterday, was I, I think we're just in dire need of positive images of the long-term future. Um, and you know, that's part of our job too, right? That's part of our job. And, and, and maybe there is a combination of those two in that these uh, positive long-term images uh, have a sense of, I don't know, achievability. So they don't just look like some uh, airy fairy utopia land that's just not, doesn't look like we can ever get there. And um, so I think, you know, it really, in the work that we've done and looking at, you know, how do people think about the future? I think it's cloudy, it's fearful, and there's not this sense of here's where we need to go. So I think that could be, you know, that, that's something that, uh, you know, future say is a core part of our mission. And, and I wouldn't say, I'm not sure that if we're neglecting it, but I, I don't see that we've put any particularly compelling images out there. Now, again, that's one thing that I'm trying to, in my recent work, I'm trying to do. So I guess I'm promoting my own idea here, if you'll allow that. But I, I mean, it really starts like, it, look, if, if that is a gap, then let's get in there and start doing it. Um, and not just uh, wait for other people to do it, right? So I guess that, that, that would be, the, so it's that sort of combination between, you know, we, st we still do need big thinking, big I new ideas, compelling ideas. Um, and at the same time, that sort of practical, uh, the ability to build that pathway in a practical sense. So I, I think it's probably somewhere, some mix between those two things.